the Maladetta is not the highest mountain in Spain, but it crowns the massif above the town of Belesque. In some ways, it's more of a challenge than climbing the Anito. The route is less clear and it's steeper and more difficult at the top. This is the ranger's hut at the hospital to Banasque, where most of the information you'll be told is unreliable. But you can leave the car here and take the bus a couple of miles to Baserta, where the footpath starts and ascends to the Renclusa hut. then climbs above the hut and quickly gains altitude. And very soon you're walking, hopping and jumping over rocks and boulders, and these rocks and boulders carry on for the rest of the ascent. There are plenty of cairns, but these don't mark any particular route and aren't really very helpful. The summer route is to go up to the superior pultilon, which is marked by a metal lantern. You go through the superior portalon and then you can see the Anito Glacier. Rather than transversing the glacier eastwards to the Anito, the direction is to continue south, below the steep rocks on the ridge. You can get onto the ridge and this shows the Pico de Abadias. And there's a gash on the ridge that is misleading because it leads nowhere. The best way up to the summit of the Maladetta is to identify a very characteristic rock on the ridge. This looks like a dark red searchlight pointing up at the sky. It's a hexagonal flat fronted rock. We went up a gully just to the left of this rock which seemed to be fairly straightforward without ropes or any other equipment. Once on the ridge, it's a matter of going along a couple of hundred metres and you're on the summit.